The updated second generation Haval Dago hybrid crossover has entered the Chinese market. The vehicle is equipped with the latest version of the Hi4 power plant with 378 brake horsepower. Only one configuration is available for purchase, which proves to be more expensive than its predecessor. The updated second generation Hi4 Harvard Dago has not changed much in terms of exterior and interior, retaining the iconic design features of the dog family, which is loved by many car enthusiasts. The only difference between the versions is the blue background underneath the logo, which emphasizes the presence of the electrical components of the power drive. The huge radiator grille, sculpted bonnet and muscular wheel arches give the car a confident and aggressive look. Front and rear LED optics and 19-inch alloy wheels add a modern touch to the crossover. The main changes affect the hybrid power plant of the updated Haval Dago 2. Its previous version was equipped with a 1.5-litre combustion engine that produced 154 horsepower. It was paired with a 177-horse electric motor. This version was front-wheel drive only. The Dagos, despite their fierce appearance, proved to be true gentlemen. But now Haval has corrected this shortcoming. The updated second-generation Harvard Dago is equipped with the Hi4 hybrid powertrain. The power of the petrol engine under the bonnet has been increased to 167 horsepower using a series parallel hybrid unit. An electric motor with an output of 95 horsepower helps him spin the wheels on the front axle. At the rear there is an electric motor with 204 horsepower connected to a two-speed DHT gearbox. The total power of the system is 378 horsepower and 750 newton meters. Acceleration to 100 kilometers takes just 6.3 seconds. The crossover's power cell has also changed. The previous version of the hybrid system was powered by nickel cobalt manganese batteries with a capacity of up to 20 kilowatt hours, produced by Great Wall Company's fault. The updated version comes with a more durable iron phosphate analog from Ningda Times with a capacity of 19 kilowatt hours. This version has an electric range of 102 km according to the Chinese CLTC cycle. The official combined fuel consumption after battery charging is 1.83 litres per 100 km. The crossover has a total power reserve of more than 1,000 km. The power plant has nine operating modes. For example, the car can move only with the help of the electric motor at the rear or only with the help of the electric motor at the front, the engine can be connected to the wheels or charged only for the traction battery. The all-wheel drive system also has seven modes, sport, mud, sand, etc. The second generation Haval Dago Hi4 has a ground clearance of 200 mm, an approach angle of 24 degrees and a departure angle of 30 degrees. There are also 22 sensors for advanced driver assistance functions, including 12 ultrasonic radars, 5mm wave radars and 5 cameras. Consumers can choose from 5 exterior colors, gray, white, black, orange and brown. The car's interior design will remain unchanged. The car will have a 12.3-inch digital instrument cluster and a huge 14.6-inch center screen controlled by Coffee Smart Intelligence with a top-end 8-core Qualcomm Snapdragon 8155 processor with a projection screen for the driver also making an appearance. There's a row of physical buttons below the center screen. Other features include 50-watt wireless phone charging, voice recognition, wireless updates, and remote control via a mobile app that remotely controls heated and ventilated seats, lighting, air conditioning, and other features. The standard layout accommodates five people with a standard boot volume of 483 liters. Cargo volume can be increased to 1,362 liters by folding down the rear seats. The dimensions of the vehicle are 4705 in length, 1908 in width and 1780 mm in height with a wheelbase of 2810 mm. The second generation Haval Dago Hi4 plug-in hybrid SUV has officially entered the Chinese market and is priced at 179,800 Chinese yuan, about 25,000 US dollars.
The Chinese market is going through an interesting period right now. The so-called price war has been going on since last year. Companies are constantly adjusting the prices of their cars in order to make the best offers to their customers. This confrontation is still relevant as BYD recently reduced the prices of most of its models by 20,000 yuan or 2,700 US dollars. But Haval decided to buck the trend and the updated second generation Dago Hi 4 is surprisingly more expensive than the previous version. In return, it offers a number of significant improvements. Thank you for watching. If you are interested in the video, please leave your gratitude and share a comment. If you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, please do so. All the best and see you on the channel.